This time I didn't. I remembered to hit record. Okay, it's Sunday, July 28th, 10.56 a.m. And uh, yesterday, I tried doing some streaming two times, but my network decided otherwise. So I couldn't really get into it too long. And this morning, I spent about two hours trying to get the network thing to work, and it magically works now. <clears throat> And I cannot figure out why, because I tried turning off, I tried diagnosing, debugging the problem. I still don't know why it suddenly works. Okay. Um, and I came very close to saying, forget this live stream shit. And I'm just, because I think it'd be kind of nice, actually, not to, not to film this all the time. Because I kind of get like. I don't know if obsessed is the right way of talking about it, but I get very much like I need to finish it. Like once I start something, I have to wrap it up. I have to continue or something kind of pushes me. So what I'm trying to say is I felt like obligated to continue this live stream thing, even though nobody really watches. A couple of people do, but fuck. Okay, let's... Uh, Let's look at this thing. How do I make it better? Okay, I think what might make this thing look a little bit better is some dark lines here because that'll make it look like water. And I was thinking about maybe putting green behind here, blasting that off. I don't know. There's something about this thing that's just not resolving nicely. And even down here, it doesn't it feels just too... Okay. So let's just uh, let's get some of this blue in here. I like this turquoise. Oh, let me just make sure it's filming. I mean, recording on the different sys systems and whatnot. Okay, so D Live, I think it's working. I think if I see Facebook's there. There's one person watching me. I don't know who you are, freaking me out. Who the hell are you? Who's watching me? Oh yeah, there's a what's that other one that pick art pick art too. Pick art. Oh, where's that coming from? Ooh. Oh, it's, I think I have like one person on Twitch who watches me. That's probably more than enough. Pick art too. Okay. Oh, I see I'm not logged in. That's why maybe it's not working. Can I just, give me a second here. <clears throat> All right, I got a heart from somebody. Woo woo! From Rosa Fida Fidelo. Oh, five people are watching. God damn it! What are you sons of bitches doing on a Saturday, Sunday morning, eleven a.m.? Should be, should be uh, doing anything but this. Okay. Oh, I think I might start this diet for a week where you only eat uh, chicken and uh, broccoli and rice. And I tried to convince one of my best friends to do it with me. He's like, no. And I said, come on, we'll be, we'll have actually have a good reason to be cranky all the time. I might still do it. This is too nice of a blue. It needs to be, um, let's try navy blue. God, my eyes are definitely going out. One of my eyes is so out of focus. When I close this, it's so blurry. And then this one is clear. I'm really good at avoiding these things. I like to complain about it. Ah, oh, you son of a... Ah, fuckers. All right. Okay. No, no, these colors are what I want. I want. Where's the black? Give me the black. Jet black. Okay, that's enough there. A little bit of black. A little bit of this blue. What kind of blue is that? See, me? Oh, yeah, I wanted to muddy it up a bit. Okay. Those kind of thing is if I had this darker kind of color here. It might make it look more like water. So 
So if there's a reflection, it's probably, it should come down here. Here. Let's make this even more. Okay, get black and this dark blue. And let's just choose like some streaks across here. Because you know what? Who knows? Who knows? Ooh, it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice. Maybe I'll do some more of those over here. I'll bring them dark and... Ooh, is that too dark? Fuck it, who knows? <clears throat> Oop. Bump the camera. So it's all wiggling and waggling. Jiggling and jaggling. Dun, 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 dun. In the wind's wonderland. Does that look like water now? Does that look better? Or does it look worse? It's a good question. It's a question for the ages. So I have these things. I should probably do those kind of like reflections as if these are in the water. Smoke on the water. Fire in the sky. Boom, 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 boom. Smoke on the water, fire in the sky. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, where's the black? I need the black to come in here. Okay, so that's sort of like some water. I don't know if I like that. Good morning. Cheryl, Jesus Christ. What's happening, Cheryl? Okay. The f Where the hell did goddamn black go? Come here, you son of a bitch. Ah! I could have swore I had a big thing of black. <clears throat> Maybe I should use up this little black one first. here is there gonna be like black what is this black what is this weird thing I'm drawing painting doodly doodly what is it awesome Mar hey hey Mar Maruzio Keikatsu Fai does that mean wait Keikatsu Fai it's like what the fuck are you doing or something hey Maruzio I love Italians I love Italians. I spent a couple months in Siena, Italy. Hey, oh, hey. Actually, they don't really talk like that. But they do have really shitty lunches. Lunches in Italy suck. They're like, you get a little piece of bread and a tiny piece of meat and that's it. And But the dinners are awesome. Breakfast is like you have an espresso. That's like breakfast in Italy. That's what I remember. Like in Canada, you eat like a breakfast. It's like you eat like a half a freaking cow and you eat like a half a loaf of bread and like peanut butter. That's like Canadian breakfast. Box of cereal. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating just a touch. Okay, what else we got here? Hey, hey, oh, hey, oh. I think I've been watching. What was I watching? What does this remind me of? I think I was watching a comedy show. Hey, oh, hey, oh. Just recently. That's why I'm doing my that Italian kind. Okay, what if I even put what if I put took some white? White and put some white across here. Made it much more extreme. Hey, oh, hey. Who does that? was watching it was a bunch of comedians were all together Don Ch 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 Chikio whatever I forget the guy's name 
Looks sexy. Goddamn right it's sexy. Fucking Wesley, where the hell you been? Yep, let's dry it up. Oh yeah, I was watching a comedy thing. It was like a round table with Jim Carrey. Don Don Ch Chilpy, whatever the fuck that guy's name. He's like he played um God, he played like the you know this really dramatic sh movie with Hotel and Rhodesia Rwanda or something. Hotel Rwanda or something, I think. Anyway, uh him and about like, you know, four other really famous comedians that you'd remember either you know, and then it's one other guy. <laughs> and the other guy who I didn't even recognize is talking the most. <clears throat> All right. I don't know what I'm babbling about. I'm just talking a bunch of bullshit. Talking a bunch of butch bullshit. Lasagna is napped in Visit Italy? What are you talking about, Cheryl? What is even Visit Italy? Lasagna is an appetizer. Actually, I made lasagna about four or five days ago for the first time in my life. It was awesome. I should have took a picture of it. Oh, that's where I remember. We were, I was listen we were listening to like happy Italian songs. That's what we were doing, and and I think a YouTube just played. Oh, okay, I'm gonna shut that up. All right, let's just get this sucker done, shall we? Lasagna is awesome. All right. Okay, so I made this a more orange. I guess I have to talk Italian in a Italian accent. I'm gonna have to do it. When I was a kid, I actually had a lot of Italian friends. I think it was my neighborhood. The neighborhood I grew up in had a lot of Italians in it. Trying to remember my friends with Frank Tatino. Frank Tatino. Hey, Frank! Frank! God, I haven't seen that guy since I was probably a grade six. Frank Tatino. Angelo. What was his last name? Angelo. I forget Angelo's last name. He's a nice guy. Frank Tatino, Angelo. Oh, and I got a funny story where I almost got beat up by one of the one of those Italian brothers. No, I'm taking Frank Angelo. Oh my god, they're on the tip of my tongue. Yeah, I just can't remember. God, what the hell are their names? That's sad. Can't remember their names. Hey, Frank. Frank Tatino. Oh, Carlos Alves. Carlos Alves was a wicked hockey player. He was like a super jock and a super awesome guy. Carlo Alves. And he was like really Italian. He definitely had that Italian flair to him. And I became friends with another guy years and years later, who turns out was buddies with Carlos. Carlos was like always was probably like the biggest kid in my grade, and he was like a wicked hockey player. That's what I remember about him. And we used to we used to go sometimes to like the schoolyard and just like shit. What do we? I think we played tennis ball. That's right. We used to take slap shots at each other with tennis balls. Carlos Alves. Okay. All right. So we got a bit of this going on. Now the question is, what am I going to do? I don't know. Am I happy with that? I'm not sure why I'm happy with this. Oh, here we go. Let's just leave it like that. I don't even know if that, what, it doesn't even look like water. It's just weird. It's just fucking weird. It's psychedelic. This thing's tripping me out. Okay. Okay. okay, so what should I do up here? 
Hmm. I was thinking about is for some reason my oh Sien is beautiful, but you should come in Termoli and try traditional food Palote Chaccio e Ovo. Fuck I love Italian. This is the coolest language to speak. Cheese and eggs, meatballs. Holy shit, that sounds good. Pelote Cacchio e Ovo. Okay, let's look up where Maurizio, is that where you live? Are you in right now in this is probably what I like the most about this live streaming is I get to talk to people like freaking all, all over the world. Like last night we were talking to somebody who lived in like the mid Atlantic on an island. It was like, what the hell? Okay, let me just go to, let's go to my desktop and let's go to DuckDuckGo because I don't use Google. And we're going to type in Termoli. Let's find out where Termoli is. Hey, I've been to Mole. What are you gonna do? Okay, let's open up the map. I oh, 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 someone's on D Live. Whoop, whoop. Open chest push. Yeah, I don't know how the hell to open the chest. You tell me to open it. I'm, I'm happy to open it. Um, Del Army, you can have the whole chest. I don't know how to do the damn thing. Okay, let me just, uh, let me just look at where Tamoli is first. Uh. San Gimiano? Wait, oh, I thought that was San Gimiano because I've been there. San Gimiano. I got some good stories about San Gimiano. Okay, we're, zip, we're zooming out. Okay, there's Rome. Uh, so it's kind of in the south ish. Oh, I don't want this thing. Okay, so more is a town and commune. Yeah, yeah. I, well, okay, Del Army, I don't know how to open it. You, if you explain to me how to like how to open it, I'll open the damn thing and you can have it. You can have the whole chest. I don't even know how the hell to do it. See, this is what I see. Del Army, this is what I got on my screen. You show me where on the screen I can open the chest, and I'll happy to open it. But I don't know. The only thing I got is this button here, and when I click it, it says download the app. And I'm I'm on a, I'm on a desktop, so it's all up to you, Del Army, Delhi Delhi Army. Oh, I like Delhi. So Delhi, it's up to you, buddy. If you can type in what I'm supposed to do, I'll do it all just for you. Okay. In the meantime, we have important business to discuss, which is Termoli. Where in the we gotta look at Termoli to find out oh, what the hell? You can't just click that. Oh, here, click this button. Okay, Termoli. Okay, I think if I can locate Brindisi, dude, don't you understand the words coming out of my mouth? You can say please, but I, I don't know how to do it. What do you want from me? Okay, I don't even know where Siena is, to be honest. I can't remember. Here's Rome. Florence is here, so maybe it's around here somewhere. Okay, let's get back to painting. Um, let's go put everything back where I like it. I'll put this here so I can read read people's text. Let's go back to the top. Top. Okay. All right, Del Army, I'm telling you, man, you got to type in how to do it. And I'll be happy to, to release the chest, the chest of money, whatever it is. Sienna's beautiful. I, I would totally go to that place, Maruzio. Okay, all right. So, so I'm, I'm gonna wait till uh, Delhi Army explains how to open the chest. In the meantime, I'm gonna continue this little painting. And what I'm thinking about is right up here. I'm not too crazy about it up here. It's kind of like, what is this? What is this mess? So I might. I was thinking we doing is maybe just add, yeah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some white, white and green. And and let's make the hills are alive behind it so we can see it. You can do it. So 
kind of like this. Let's just try to get a... Yeah, that's a better composition. A. Hey, it's a better composition. See if I can take this super horrible color, leaf green, do something with it. It's kind of gross. It's a leaf green. Da 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 da. Yeah, I guess the, I guess uh, the old uh, A. Simone. Where do I know you're from, Simone? Are you the one that was living in the, the middle of the damn Atlantic Ocean, Simone? Was that you last night? I gotta remember, uh, not so good within the, with the, with just names. Which is not good for me because all I can see are names and I gotta try to remember. Simone, are you from last night? In the, sitting in the, in the Atlantic, you're the drug dealer sitting in, in the Atlantic. Hey. Oh, hey. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I'm just looking at the composition of my screen. Can't say I like it yet. It's kind of a little craptastic. It's a little craptastic. I want to go to Italy again. Oh, Italy. I was 17. I was so young. Yeah, but Cheryl, is that Simone from last night? Living in the A-zones? A-zones? Simone's our, is our cocaine dealer friend. Drug pusher, pretending to live in the A zones, trading cows. <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. I know you're not a drug dealer. Don't worry. The FBI is not coming for you. Well, wait a second. The FBI wouldn't come for you because you would not be an Americano. Holy stuff. The stuff that just comes out of my mouth is just so ridiculous. Azores. Yeah, I don't know either. It's a good question. Question for years. It's a question for the ages. Uh, Sound of music. Okay. Hmm. That's a little bit better. The composition's a tiny bit better. Hey, hey, hey. What are you going to do? I don't know. What are you going to do? What am I going to do? What are we going to do? I like how it's going to be kind of, kind of a little bit abstract. A little bit abstracting it up. Mm-hmm. Okay. See how it got darker? Isn't that kind of neat? I just had to wait about about a minute or two, and then the gouache. Like if you could go back in time, you could probably go back in time. But if you go back in time and look, it was so much lighter, and I just had to wait like a minute or two, and then it just completely lightened up. I don't know if you know what I'm doing, but I'm doing a little bit of reflections. Making it so it looks like whatever I put up here comes below. Hey, it's above, it's below, it's on top, I don't know. What are you going to do? Let's go like this and put it up here. And then for the water reflections, I'm just bringing it across. Oh, I'm a doll. Natasha Fly. What's up, Natasha Fly? Oh, we got someone from Twitch. Holy shit. Do you know that you're probably... You know, I think I've had one other person from Twitch come on here. What's up, person on Twitch? Natasha Fly. Ah, uh, thanks. Appreciate it. You know what I like? I love when I go to some place and someone calls me dear. I'm like, oh, that's so nice. Where else do you stream? Well... I'm multi-streaming, so normally, well, <laughs> until a week ago, I was doing uh, YouTube, but I got banned from YouTube 
for three months from live streaming. But I also do it on Facebook. So right now I'm on Facebook, not YouTube, because fuck, they blocked me for three months. Pick Art 2, but I don't really use it to be honest. So, oh, sorry, DLive. DLive is the other one. But if you go to my website, it's all, all the info is on my website, druckman.com. That's my last name. If you really want to know. I just turned on Twitch. I don't I don't, I don't even I don't even think I set up one of those uh you know the home page where it describes your stuff? I don't even think I even did that for Twitch. And I might actually stop doing this live streaming. Cause I don't know if you can see behind me. Let me show you. Oh, I got banned because it's, it's so ridiculous. I was doing one of these live paint, painting sessions and I was I put on I don't know if you know Key and Peel. I think that's how you pronounce their names. There's this comedy sketch duo and they're freaking hilarious. And I and it wasn't even it was just like in a window and I watched about two two, three minutes of it and laughing my ass off and talking. Literally like less than a reaction video. Um out of about like an hour of live streaming, it was just like two two, three minutes of it. And I got a strike that said uh, you are now banned from live streaming for three months and I can't uh, I did immediately say it was fair use because it was like it was like a reaction video it was like even less than that but I think it's because I really don't have any followers like on YouTube I think there's like maybe 30 people <laughs> so I think you know you're just fuck it you know whatever they don't uh, they don't really uh... there's you know, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Hey. Okay. Um, uh, reasons I never stream on YouTube. Wait. Meet me. Get you tons and tons of views? That sounds like a... Like a... Like a... Like a... Uh, some sort of dating site. Come on. Meet me. Natasha. Where are you going with meet me? I'm just... By the way, I like to screw with people. I'm not... I don't know. You don't know me yet, so um, I'll check out Meet Me. See if it's real or, or legit or not. Why would I get tons of views? No one likes looking at it. It's a social app. To be honest, I can't keep up. I, I like, just like, I gotta, I can't keep up with the social media. It's too much for me. I guess you could date people if you wanted. Well, I don't know. Hey, Mark, look at this fucking thing, Mark. Just a better algorithm. Look at these damn flat rocks, man. They don't get much flatter than this. All the time. Flat rocks, flat rocks, blah, blah, blah. All right, I'm almost done. I think I'm getting done. I'm talking to Mark right now because he's... Always yapping about flat rocks, this flat rocks, that non stop. Okay, <clears throat> okay, so I think I know what I want to do. I'm going to tell me about you. Hey, tell me about you. What are you going to do? What are you gonna do? What do I? What do you say? I don't know. I'm just somebody likes to do the arty things. Okay. I made video games for 25 years. Tried to be an artist. Failed miserably when I was young. Couldn't couldn't live. So I made video games. But that not, not so. I also love making video games. Still do. But this is my real dream, to do the art. To do the art. Problem is, the trick is, how do you do something new? That's my conundrum is, how do you do something original when so much has already been done before? That's, that's my big conundrum. 
So I want things to be masterful and original. The original, you can master something. That part I can do. The original part is hard. So I'll take care of your flat rights. How big the frame? This thing is 10 by 14 inches. So what I would do is you take it to a framer and they will put a, it should be under glass and it has to be in a frame. Uh, why would I say if I'm marrying kids? I'm not telling you that. Okay. Um, now you do sound like some sort of weirdo dating website thing. So what you do is, is you put it under, you put it under glass and they'll put, I'm sure you probably know this, right? But I would probably put a, a two inch white border. I have, oh fuck, all my paintings are upstairs that are framed on my little ones. I would put like maybe inch and a half, two inch white border. And it's just going to, because this painting goes to the edge, you could do it two ways. I like to see, I like the fact it's not perfect. Okay. That's sort of my thing here. Druckmann Art, what's up? I usually watch art streams, but you're good. Hey, thanks, man. Zimmer Tracks 148. Okay. Um, I had to talk to Mark for a second. We're talking about, because this is his. This is Mark's. My friend Mark, the French Canadian in Quebec. Hey, what are you going to do? Now I'm Italian again. All right. Okay. Yeah. So two, I do like uh, probably white. Now there's two ways. One, you could go in. You could. Come here. You could take the white framing paper and go in so you get a perfect edge. Of course, you're going to be cutting out part of the part of the stuff. So like that. The advantage of that is you're, well, I was going to say it, could grip the, it grips the paper better. But since you're going to put it under glass, it's going to be pressed. So it won't matter. And then you do like uh, some kind of nice frame color that matches. What I like to do is, is there's two places near me. They're master framers. And, and I always get their recommendation what they think. Right, basically you look at it and then you what they do is like it depends on how expensive you want to go with frames, but they have like any frame shop will have a whole selection of of frames and styles and it depends what you like. Um But I would yeah, and, and you look at the colors and you see what would balance it. Um I personally what I do is I'd only frame it to like a quarter inch. See where that yellow tape is? This is just holds it on. I'd frame it right there so you get all the white space and you get the weird the fact that it looks weird because that's just the way I like I, I like it. And then you do your your border of white and then your frame and then you're good to go. Okay, enough of that shit. All right, so I love the fact that it's rugged and flat. Yeah, would love to be as relaxed as that with my well fuck. Well, see, my trick is I have no life outside of doing this. This is it. This is all I got. So that's, so, so, you know, I'm going to be relaxed about this. I love it. I love it. Okay. So here's a bit more water reflection-y things. I got to go check out this dating site, meetme.com. Now, where are we, where are we folks? Are we near done this thing? Hmm. 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 It's like, what is this? Can I make this better? Is it possible? Yes, with a little bit of brown. A little bit of brown. Oh yeah, I was gonna say one of the reasons why I might just stop live streaming for a while is because of this. I'm gonna go to front view. I don't know if you can see behind me. But these are some big motherfuckers. One of the, there's 48. Oh, what a dumbass! You got me the wrong size. Oh, I swear to God, the guy's a fucking moron. I ordered these canvases and I wanted four by. Six and four by seven. He gets me. This, these two are four by eight feet. Fuck. Oh, what a moron. Oh, I swear to God, he's so stupid. Four by eight feet. Look at that. 
reason why I got a commission to do a four by seven foot. And it took weeks for those things to get here because they got to custom order them. And this guy, oh God, now I got to go tell the dude, oh, by the way, you wanted a four by seven? Can you, you want to take a four by eight? Oh, that's no annoying. I did it over the phone. Because this is a guy I normally call to work. He's, he's always so spazzy. He's like, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. I'm on it. I'm we're going to do this right away. Oh, I'm going to call confirm and everything. <sighs> okay. We have a homemade paper mill close to home. We'll look at very rough texture of paper, perhaps as backing. You try to do it yourself. Well, that's ambitious. Oops. Where was I? Here. Nope. I don't want to see that. Yeah, I gotta fix a couple things up here. With oh man, that really is so annoying. Holy shit. I don't even know if I can fit. No, I've done, there's a four by eight painting back there. So I was just saying, I've got this painting space. My painting studio is over here really. And uh, normally I do, I do seven foot wide paintings a lot and it fits perfectly. Eight feet is going to be pretty cramped. Simple. I just, just get it right the first time. Okay, I don't know. I'm kind of pissed off now. I was all set to go start this this thing, and now I can't. Now I look like an idiot for calling up the guy and say, oh, by the way, the thing that's been taking forever to get, because I've been waiting about three weeks now for, for those canvases to show up. They just came, I think, yesterday. Or what day? It's Friday, I think. Now I've got to call the guy and say, you um, know, I can't start for another month because uh don't have the right canvases, and I look like a fucking idiot. <sighs> I swear to God, I didn't get a, even a, like, he just kept on talking so fast last time. He, he's just a spaz. He's a spaz. That's the only way to describe it. He's a super spazzy guy. Very friendly. Now he sounds like he's, he's like, it's like his head's falling off. He's like, okay, I'm not, I, you know, I'm supposed to have lunch, but I'm, but how about if I do your order before lunch? Let me go upstairs and just do I'm like, okay, just fucking just chill out. Just, you know, just really just take your time. In fact, I even told him, said, listen, no worries. Go have your lunch. We'll figure this thing out. He's like, no, no, no. I, you know, I, I got 15 minutes. I'm going to go do it. And he's at the, like, the, he's like the art, he's like the um, main art uh, what's it called? Agent, I guess we do call it for like, like the, the main, like in Toronto, we've got like this one really old art store that I've been going to for like 20, 30 years more. And he's like the main guy you order from. You know, so I've got a relationship with, I know the guy, like he immediately gives me like the discounts immediately just says, okay, we're gonna get this thing done. And I actually asked him just to confirm it by email and I should have been insistent. So I'm the fool. I'm the fool for not being thorough. Okay, well, what the fuck is this weird thing? I want this maybe to come down. I think it looks better if it comes down. Down here. Yeah, let's just let's do some little bit of things here. And then let's come and let's uh do that. Okay. Okay, so if I want to come here, let's just do this. Okay. What's up? A very G King. How's it going, man? Woman. Whoever you are. 
Maybe you can find out. Avera, Avera G. Someone asked me to release my chest, okay? I'm happy to do it. I just don't... I thank you. Thanks. Thank you. I uh, I just don't know how to do the whole chest thing. Like, there's no one has explained to me how to release it because there's nothing... There's no option on, on my screen. So I'm happy to give it away. I just don't know how. And... Uh, I just don't feel like making that much of an effort to try to figure it out. So, if you can tell me how to do it, I'll release it. Release it. For people who are not on DLive, basically, let me just show you what I'm talking about. Right, here we go. On DLive, which is, this is the DLive interface. It's weird, you gotta make it... No, I'm not gonna Google how to, that's too much work. I figured... So this is what DLive looks like for all you YouTube farts like me. Basically, you know how you can release chests. So there's, I got ten linos built up in my chest, and I can give them away to all you people, right? People on D Live, but I don't see on the interface where to release it. When I click this chest button, it just oh fuck! Now okay, I swear to God. Okay, wait a second. <laughs> I swear, if you were watching me before, I pressed that button and it said download the app. Watch, I click it here. Say, so look at that. Download app to claim treasure tour chest. So look at this. This is the thing about the D Live interface that bugs me. Is this is weird stuff like that. So the whole time, unless I happen to expand the window to the point, I have to go here. And now when the chest is positioned here and no longer in the chat, look, it, it's different. Okay, so let's release this thing. Okay. Distribute awards. The more your viewers. Okay, here we go. Let's click it. Wait, we gotta do a countdown. I hope this all goes to Avera G King. Last dude who was here, um, where was he? Delhi Army. If you're still around, now's your chance, buddy. Okay, so let's release this money. I have no idea much. It's probably nothing. Okay, distribute awards. Three, two, one. Click. You're now distributing the rewards. Chess rewards will distribute in twenty. Five seconds, four, three, three. I wonder what's going to happen. Let's find out. Okay, let's find out. I, I did this once a long time ago. And I just forgot. I, it was all because this stupid chest button only works when your window's stretched out. Okay. Let's see what happens. I'm hoping that Avera G gets it. Just because you're the last person to be here. Okay, here we go. Luckiest followers. <laughs> No winners this time. What? What does that even mean? That's a ripoff. What? How can they... I don't get to do it again right away? You have to wait 10 minutes before opening another chest. That is a ripoff. How... Why would they not just give it away to some of the... Followers? That is weird. Like, if I was to do a set it up for a random prize, you pick randomly some of your followers, right? Why would they not give it away to someone? Oh, look, you can hear myself. Okay, let me pause that. Okay, so I guess I got to wait 10 minutes before. Uh... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how it works. That is so weird. Okay, all I know now is that I have to have the window expanded in order in order to be able to do it. And we've just learned that the DLive prize mechanism doesn't guarantee to give it away. That's kind of weird. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Now I'm just gonna think, is this painting finished? No, I think, I think I can see a couple things I wanna do. I think I kind of want to have a little bit of a line definition down here. Like a line definition up here a little bit. Yeah, I kind of want this. I'm not quite sure. Okay. Is there anything else? Maybe another one like, like this? And I wanted this to come down here. So let's just, let's just do a little bit of painting that I'll... Well, actually, Avera... You didn't get nothing implies that you got something. That's a double negative. Come on, man. I did not receive anything, is how you would describe it. Jeez, for fuck's sake. 
It's like, you know, I taught English in Japan. Can you tell? I didn't get nothing means you got something. Do you understand the logic? All right. We're gonna, we might call this one done very soon. I just wanted it to come down here. Oh, hey. Ah, that's a better. Hmm, I wonder if I should put a bit more orange to... Thank you. Thank you. I thank you. Oh, that's nice. Look at these little Van Gogh type of lines. That's beautiful. Right on, man. I like it too. Okay. I think, I think, you know what, Mark, I, it's, that's it. I have, I don't think I've signed a, the past 50 or 60 pieces I've done. I gotta, I gotta sign this thing. Cause I always forget to sign it. In fact, signing is the thing I hate, I like the least. I am either gonna, nice. I'm either gonna, what, am, am I gonna give you a, I'm gonna get, yeah, I'm gonna write my name. In fact, I like writing my name better than signing. I like that. In fact, most of the time I write my name, so that's what you're going to get. Okay, so the best part is my handwriting is like five-year-olds. Okay. I think, it, okay, so here's the thing, buddy. I'm going to do it down here, which means you got no choice, sucker, to, to, but to go to the edge with your framing, because otherwise you're going to cut off my signature, and then you're fucked. Because I don't feel like, I don't think it'll look good if I wrote on top of this part. All right, so here we go. I'm just going to put Druckmann. What year is it? 2019 okay honestly this is like the hardest thing for me d do i want to look at okay uh, yeah no i'm not doing the rocks i don't want to fuck up the rocks dru oh i hate this so much this is like annoying okay drug it's like effort and lowercase a and there you go Whew. oh i forgot the year Let's do a 19, because it's just like, you know, it's cooler. Do you want 2019? I normally just put the, like, ninth. Wait, what year is it? Jesus Christ, that's embarrassing. What fucking year? 2019. I usually put them just 19, because I always, here's, here's something funny. Whenever I sign pieces, I usually run out of space, because I just, I, so I've started writing um, on most paintings going backwards, with the N, and I always forget to put the year, so the year is usually cranked up somewhere. Okay, so I'm just gonna put, I'll put, I'll give you the full year, because I got space here. All right. Okay. Jeez, I'm gonna fuck it up, I know it. I'm ter I don't know, people can be so careful about it. Two, oh, one, Done! Bam! The sucker's done. All right, is it done? Mm, I don't know. Kind of think that maybe. See, I just noticed this now. I noticed a couple things. There's this nice big gray blotch, but that could be a reflection. Is that? Could this be improved? I kind of feel like. Do I feel like the sky? Yeah, I think I'm going to do this last little bit. And then it'll be awesome. It's not awesome yet. Where's my white? Okay. I know what's gonna make it three times more awesome. I'm just gonna take a bit of white. And I'm gonna go like this. Oh yeah, that was missing. Cause the sky was too uniform. 
sucked. Hiccup. And then... Feel the wind. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let me get rid of that part right there. Ooh, that looks way better. Come on, where's the god? Why is it so blurry? Oh, I forgot to put autofocus on. Come on, you son of a gun. Autofocus. Wait, autofocus off. Does it look blurry? I can't tell if it's my eyes. Cause I, oh, there we go. Okay, what's, what's the screen? Ah, hey, ooh, ooh, hey, hey. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, it needed the it needed to break up the 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 stupid little lines there. I needed a little bit of a little bit of uh, snibbly bits and garshnoople farts. You need a little bit of that. You know what I'm talking about? These are high technical words. I know that if you're not educated, you don't fully understand, but that's okay. Okay. Okay, Mark, we're done. Let's get the hell. Oh, wait a second. Okay, all right, there we go. Look at this little weird place. Look at this fucked up place. Like, would you, what is going on here? I don't understand. Wait. wait. There's the flat rocks. Never going to be done again. And I have these cool little weird bushes that go into these trees and then they have this weird circular thing happening here and then you could i like this part over here i think that's nice i love i love this bit right here with these little which could be birch trees in the dark forest kind of thing then you got this i'm semi okay with and then we got our weird reflections you know just sort of and then the sky starts over here And there's that little blob I just put on there. I just wanted a bit of texture. I wanted to break up that. There you go. Am I happy with it? Am I just going to let it go? There's a couple things that will... Oh. Here's something just between you and me then. Okay. If I was... Re it's weird that there's no oranges being picked up from here to here. Because it's going right to the reds, which are up here. Right? You would expect to see those oranges reflected down here. Not Kebab Quatech words. Yeah, and I just made up a bunch of shit. You know that. Okay. Just looking for some, seeking out some, it's like a mosquito searching out. Okay. Trying to find and see if I had any wet paint left. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna call it quits after this. This is gonna dry a little darker, so it's all gonna be good. Just trying to see where my okay. That'll that'll make it nice. Nice. Hey, is it good to nice? It's a nice. I think I kind of get a little obsessive sometimes with this, don't I? It's got to be if it doesn't have if I don't feel like it's art, it's not done. All right, I think that's good. All right, there you go. How much time am I streaming? Like just now, it's been an hour and a half. I don't know if you mean in general. <clears throat> really depends when I have time. I do as much as I can, but I also have very limited energy too. I have like, uh, I have, uh, I hate to say health problems, but that's just the truth. So I can, you know, so here's what happens. If I do like an, an hour, an hour and a half of this, I sometimes I'm wiped out for the day. It's fucking weird. It's like, it takes all my, like after this, I might have to go crash. It's like, it's like some sort of weird, uh, energy bar in a video game there's been times where I'll, I'll do like honestly this is fucking no exaggeration but an hour of painting and then i can't do anything for a couple days like it just 
it's crazy. Can you make another drawing like Dex? Are you talking about Dex from Guardians of the Galaxy? The hell kind of crap. Oh, oh, I lost my mouse. Okay, I can't really do anything with my mouse's connection lost. I think Dex is the, the big, big dude from with the paint all over his body. I'm just waiting for my mouse to come back here. Come on, mouse. Come on, little mouse. Yeah, I can't do anything until... This has been happening past week where my, um, I'm losing connection to my mouse. It's not the battery. It's, oh, here we go. Okay, I'm back. All right, let's go take a look. What can I do in a drawing? Light Dex. D-E-X. Oh, wait. I got to go here. That's where I am. Dex. Who's Dex? As a YouTuber that on his profile have Dex. I have no idea what you're talking about. It's a, oh, it's, it's a YouTuber. My eyes are going. Okay, so let's go Dex. YouTube. By the way, I don't do requests, so the answer is going to be no. But um, I like talking about it. Okay, wait. Let's go to Dex YouTube. Let's see. Is he's German? Is this is this the guy you're talking about? This guy? Gamescon 2014. Oh. Ja. Wait, what was that? Yeah. German's a pretty fun language, man. It's funny. It's f makes me laugh. I had a friend who was half German, half Egyptian. Half German, half Egyptian. Okay. No, okay. Well, what's his, uh, let's just type in Dex and see what, uh, let's see who. Wait a minute. Okay, we're going to get, Avero is, is going to, oh, my live stream connection is not bad. So, just, I like to, I, I'm always up on my screen checking to see while Avero G King is, is looking up who Dex is. Over here, it tells you how many drop frames from the network. And two is like li is is acceptable, but you as an observer are going to start noting like choppy movement and stuff around ten percent, and that's when I usually stop it. And the past, I think it was all yesterday. I was I could it was going up to like eighty percent out of no. And then I spent a few hours this morning before I started this. I was going to start bright and early, man. I was up early, ready to go. Okay, um, I'm going to write. Z ZHC. Let's see. ZHC. I have a MacBook Pro, an iPhone XS, and AirPods. Now all we need to do to customize these Apple products. Oh, he's already annoying. Oh fuck no. He's already, I already can't stand this. No, I don't want your your drop beats. Take this outside. Oh, that's so bad. No. Oh, well, it looks like now it's I'm 49 years old and I'm grumpy. Put it this way. Dry? Right. We'll put our AirPods in. Oh, Jesus Christ. That guy's annoying. Okay. Okay. C custom $10,000 iPhone? Kidding me. I don't get it. I made a giant art using 10,000 Legos. I'm sorry, but al already this stuff is just gimmicky shit to me. I don't know. Uh, I like to I like to complain about it. Oh, go to hell, Wix. How do you stop it, Wix? No, I'm not gonna check it out. No. Really? A one minute ad? Sorry, but that's not gonna happen. I have a MacBook Pro. I don't care if you have a MacBook Pro. All right, let me see. Show me something that's good, because so far I would say I'm. I'm uh, here's the thing. I'm not good to talk about art because. I have a huge dislike for 99.9999% of everything out there. So I'm the wrong person to ask, but I understand what you said. Make something like this guy. First of all, I, I couldn't do it if it was like somebody else. I'll have to do the opposite. What? I paid artists $20,000 to finish my drawing? Writing's not that easy, but Grammarly can help. This sentence How do you mute this guy? Correct. How do you mute it? Oh, that's better. Okay. All right. I'm going to try to have an open mind. By the way, just so you know, I'm like almost always not being serious when I talk shit like this, by the way. I'm actually very open-minded and easygoing, but I love just complaining about this. And I only do this. Like, this is the kind of thing I do with my best friend only in the privacy of my home. But now I'm doing it openly on the internet because I'm not so smart. Okay. Let's... Oh, what? I'm doing the ad again twice? 
That's terrible. That's unbelievable. Okay, let's let's look away. Okay, that there's no way I would watch something where they play an ad twice and the second one is a minute long. How's that doesn't even make sense. Oh, it definitely is. Sorry, no, there's no chance in hell I'd ever do a drawing like that because that's like, okay, so when Photoshop did a gradient thing here, and I don't like cutesy stuff. Oh, now this guy's just all about. Uh, I can't do this, man. I was not meant to be a YouTuber. YouTuber. His profile picture? This thing? You want me to draw that, that goofy fucking dragon thing? No way. Nope, not gonna do it. Unless he had, unless you, unless you're like a billionaire, and you pace, you would have to give me tons of money and then donate tons of money to some charity that are like some weird charity. Okay, how about if I do draw it just for the fuck of it, and I'm gonna make it, I'll make it really horrible. Okay, here's what I'll do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Just because I, I feel like still working on some artsy fartsy stuff. Maybe I will draw the thing. Then afterwards, I'll, I'll burn it. How about that? Let's do that. Let's we'll draw it, then we'll destroy it. Okay, make you happy. All right, so I'm gonna stop this live stream. And the reason why I like to stop the live stream and start again is just because I could save it as a separate file, and I can I can have a copy of it, and then whatever. So maybe I'll do that. I'll, I'll, okay, here's the th uh, okay. Can you tell I've had five coffees this is my fifth coffee right here so i'm kind of like a little wired i don't think i had breakfast either so we got lots of caffeine in here it's like a little bit of a spaz out session i had okay i'm gonna stop it and i'm gonna look at this dex thing and and i'll only do it if i can come up with something cool about it and original but the problem i have is i don't like copying stuff I'll think about it. I know. Stopping this live stream. And, uh, hey, John. I'm just, uh, I'm just signing off right now, bud. Um, I just finished this little drawing painting thing here. Um, and I'm just thinking if I might start a new one because I feel like I still have more creative energy to, to, oh, I think I might go back to oil painting. And I have a couple of these little ca see right behind me, those little canvases over there. If I do oil painting, I gotta change my my situation here. I gotta bring some of the oil paints back over here. I mean, it won't take me long. Hmm, should I do an oil painting? I don't know. I don't know. Well, here's the thing. I've got it. I'm doing this little art show in in uh, seven days. And like I, I still haven't finished an e-commerce website, so I might just do that. Open the treasure. All right. Okay, fine. Let's open the treasure chest. Let's open this thing. Let's see what we can do. Okay, so we know, we've learned that you've got to stretch this thing right across. And you're gonna. There we go. Let's press it. Distribute the rewards. Da 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 da. Twenty-seven. Twenty-six. Excitement is palpable. 20 seconds. Finish them. Let's look at this. Counting down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. <gasps> Hold your breath. What's going to happen? <laughs> look at that. You got it. And my mouse died. <laughs> oh, yeah, my mouse died. Ah, for fuck's sake. God damn, mouse fucking died again. I'm stuck in this window. <laughs> That's hilarious. You got it. Yeah, my mouse is dead. Can't even turn this thing off. <sighs> Hell yeah. Okay, come on, mouse. Where are you? <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Good game. All right, I can't get this. My mouse is. Oh, my volume's off. Okay, I get my keyboard works, but my mouse is not working. 
Bum ba dum ba bum ba ba. I can't do anything and I'm stuck on the screen. It takes about 30 seconds to a minute before it usually comes back. And this only started recently. And the battery is at 50%, so it's not the battery. Come on. Come on, baby. Won't that be embarrassing if I can't turn this thing off? What am I going to do? Cannot turn off the... I mean, can't... Yeah, I can't turn off the live stream unless I would... What do I do? Unplug the cameras? Well, that's interesting. I got no mouse. Now it's just going to sit here. Do What are we going to do? Hey, we're back. We're connected again. There you go. Party time. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, so that was painting a thing. Wasn't that exciting? Um, the art show. I gotta go to my website. It's in Oakville somewhere, and I've I've like totally unprepared for it. Um, I gotta go to my website, and it says on my website, it says, uh, Art in the Park, Oakville. August 5th, just for one day. And there's a website you can go to. You can click on it. It tells you about it. So I've got one of these booths I've rented. Oh, the pictures don't even blow up. That's kind of crappy. You'd think that these would be like thumbnail pictures. You can't click on it. I hate doing these things because I, I don't like talking to people that much, to be honest. It stresses me out. Okay. Look at that grumpy son of a bitch picture. Look at that. Isn't that fucking hilarious? And I just, I really don't like taking pictures of myself. And the reason, main reason why I kept this one is because the background looks professional. I just took it upstairs in like my, my drawing room, whatever you want to fucking call it. Because it looks like the nice gradient. Isn't it? Stop that. It's a nice gradient that goes right across. It looks like it's some sort of like photo shoot. In reality, it was just the light coming off the wall. And there's another one in September, which I, I don't even, I gotta, don't even, I gotta write the words up. Okay. Here's the thing about the live streaming. Like, I've, I've created, like, a monster. Like, when you go to my, like, one of the pictures, I thought it'd be cool if you had, you'd have the painting, which you could zoom in and look at closely if your screen was bigger. Like, you like that. And you can see the picture up close. And recently, I've been taking close-ups. And this is where I was, I was putting all the live streams together so you could watch the whole painting from start to end. The problem is this stuff takes me hours to do. So I could do a painting that took me, like, an hour. And I'll spend two, three hours... Just putting the goddamn files up and, and photographing it and everything. And there's probably about a hundred or so videos that I still haven't even uploaded. It just takes so much time. Look, I haven't even uploaded these videos. Remember, I don't know if you guys remember this painting I did not long ago. Why am I doing it? I'm insane. I should, like, you know. This has got to pay off one day. This photo I have to take over again. Because look. Look how... See the color? Are, can, are you on my screen? You're my desktop? Yeah, okay. If you look at this, I've got to reshoot this. Because look, it looks too dark. Like the colors of the painting match the real thing to some like pretty closely. But this is actually white paper. So that shouldn't be dark blue. So you have to spend a lot of time. Like when it comes to actual photo photographing the artwork... It can be a lot of damn work. So like so like this one here, Haven. About two hours of painting. I'll probably have spent six, seven hours in total related to this painting. You know, there's like preparing, there's cleaning up, there's photo photograph photog photographing, there's a live scene stream, all the stuff you gotta prepare for that shit. So like it's it's yeah, plus Plus blah blah blah, but I think that's pretty cool. Eh? Is that you could uh, you can see the painting and then you could see the whole live stream. But even here, like I haven't uploaded. I do these summary videos that are about thirty seconds long or a minute long, where I talk about what I did. So even these, I haven't even uploaded those. Ah. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, I've got the other self-portrait one I haven't finished yet. Maybe that's what I'll do today. Look at this. This one. Wait. Maybe I'm gonna work on this one. Where's the e top? This painting. Maybe I'll finish this one. It's much larger. This is the one I just did here. Let me zoom out. Okay. So this is the one I just finished. And this is the one I... I have a photo photograph of myself. It's actually the same one. It's the same one, the other self-portrait. Okay. I don't know. Yeah. I was thinking about this one is maybe I'll go and I'll try to try to go in and make it somewhat realistic in areas so you know that I'm not just an idiot slapping some paint down that I'm actually I could make it realistic. Actually that nose looks kind of nice. I like that nose. The under light. Look at the little splotch of light here. And then uh, I love these lines. These imperfect, incorrect lines. I'm a fan of that. Actually, you know what? I got to deal with the fact that my the paintings I ordered are the wrong size. That's what I should do. Anyhow. Okay, I'm stopping now. I think I've rambled on enough. So, um, if I could find something cool to do about this Dex thing, I would. Otherwise, I would say there's probably 0 0.00000 chance I'll actually do it. Because that's just, no, that's like not, I don't like, I don't like cartoons. I don't like things that aren't original. I don't like. I don't like, bleh, get off my lawn, you young punks. Okay. I've now passed the point at which I'm just making any sense at all. Okay. So let's, let's say goodbye for now. And then maybe I'll be back a little later and see what happens. All right. Okay. Take it easy. <laughs> Thanks for putting up with me. <laughs> Bye.